We are back with another review and today. We got to pick up from the Funko shop. Today we're checking out from the Pop Ad Icons line. I know, I don't collect many ad icons, but the ones that I do, I do like the ones that I collect. So without further ado, let's hop right into this review because today we are checking out Woodsy the Owl Flocked Funko Shop exclusive here. So this is um, right in line with like Smokey the Bear. Um, I believe, yeah, here we go. Give a hoot, don't pollute. And then I believe there's something, lend a hand, care for the land. So that's the one that goes around the outside and that's the, the sign right there. So let's pop him out the pop shield here and let's check out what we got going on here with Woodsy the Owl. This is a pop ad icon. So I think I'm, I think I'm at like four or five of the ad icons in normal pop form. And then I have the uh, target dog in a uh, 10 inch pop form. So. This was a pickup from the Funko shop that didn't sell out. Uh, it was dropped, I want to say, earlier on this year, maybe February of this year. It was just a drop that just didn't sell out, which I was kind of surprised. I wanted to pick it up, uh, but I just kept never getting around to it. And then finally, Funko added like free shipping on their orders because I didn't want to pay $24 to this because the $15 pop or whatever ends up becoming like $23, $24 after everything's been said and done. Um, but now they added free shipping, you just go hog wild and then you don't have to pay shipping. So I think that's, I think that was the break even point for me was the fact they added a free shipping deal. So thank you Funko if you're, if you're watching, uh, we got flocked woodsy the owl and this is a sick pop. Let's see if his head moves, head moves. Very nice. doesn't seem like it has any obstruction on the arms or the shoulders which is very nice. This is a sick pop. I mean, straight out the gate, just checking out the brown flockage on this is, I mean, it's on point. The yellow flockage for the for the eyes here, around the eyes is, I mean, completely symmetrical. It looks beautiful, crisp. The black eyes here, directly centered. I mean, I like how they use the multiple parts on the face. It allowed the paint application to be perfect and crisp and not have any weird lines. Even the feather on his cap is a separate piece. So you can have that, you know, end boundary if you would because the entire piece is painted red and then it's just glued onto the green hat the arrow is the arrow and the belt buckle look, appear to be the only two things that are painted on uh, and the mouth i guess you could say the mouth's painted on the black part of the mouth but the the green arrow is spot on there's no issues there the yellow belt buckle looks superb even his little little feet there those are separate pieces but those are i believe those are painted as well uh, even his lanyard and whistle are all individual pieces. So I think well, the thing I'm noticing is when Funko does the individual pieces, but it has to be more of a simplistic pop like this. It can't be something like a, a Star Wars one because they, a lot of the guns have different colors on all of the gun. The gun has like maybe four or five colors in itself. Uh, something like that, it's hard to do different pieces, but I could see something like this really making this pop pop just because they did separate parts and i really like this um this particular pop and i like how the flockage isn't damaged at all it's nice no little we got a little giblet there i don't know what the little giblet is yep oh, it's just a little giblet gone the giblet's gone there's a little another giblet right there that giblet's gone too but yeah sometimes you get some flocking giblets on there it's not nearly as bad as the black light posters that we unboxed on this channel but it's uh it's definitely Man, this is on point right here. This is a nice pop. It's gonna make some great photos out, out in the wild when uh, when I go camping and go out into the National Forest. So it'd be real nice to bring Smokey the Bear with him as well and do some nice photo shoots out in the wild. So definitely gonna take some photos on Instagram for him. Stands up rather well. So I think he'll do, I think he'll do really good in the wild um, standing up on things. So uh, I think that's the main thing that I, reason why I picked this one up. One, cause I like this particular ad icon, but two, it's gonna be great to take him out into the national forest and take some photos with him so which let me know down in the comments below what you think of woodsy the owl did you pick up this funko a shop a drop it's uh sitting about 10 over the cost right now which is basically it shipped um which is good but uh let me know if you picked this one up and you added it to your collection and if you like ad icons let me know down in the comments below as well and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and if you want more content like this subscribe for more because i do reviews every single day so look out for that and have a great rest of your day